Hey everyone, it's Jesse from Soul Pre, and I want to talk today about something that affects all of us as athletes, sunlight. Not just sunlight though, I actually want to talk about UV rays and how they affect our skin. I think we're all familiar with the term UV rays, but you may or may not be familiar that there's actually two types of UV rays. Three really, but we're going to talk about two. UVA and UVB. The short and sweet version between the two is that UVB has more energy or power and has the potential to do more damage to your skin. You know you should wear sunblock when you go out for a run or you go out for a ride or you go to mow the lawn or really anything outside. But most likely you probably aren't super religious about putting sunblock on every single time you go outside. I know I am guilty of going out for a run in the summer without putting sunblock on. A little less so with cycling because you're out for longer, but I'm certainly not blameless in taking care of my skin at, you know, when we're out in the summertime or any time of the year. So what's the big deal? You know, maybe you get a little bit of a tan or you get burnt on occasion. Is it really an issue of you know, these things in the long term? Most often we kind of think about, yes, uh, there are long-term damage that can be done to your skin. Uh, we're gonna get little wrinkles and we can get skin discoloration. I know that I actually have several spots that have developed on my hands from UV damage over time. The more pressing issue of what UV rays do to us is actually the damage they can do on a genetic level. UV rays, in particular UVB, because it has more power, have the potential to damage our skin at the genetic level in our DNA. So how do you tell if your skin's DNA has ever been damaged by UV rays? I'll give you a second. There's a simple way to figure this out. Have you ever had a sunburn? Then yes, you can check that box your skin has had its DNA damaged by UV rays. A sunburn is actually your skin's way of trying to defend itself against further damage from UV rays. That lovely peeling effect you get after a sunburn? Well, that's actually your skin cells killing themselves off in an effort to stave off further damage to your skin system. You say you don't mind peeling skin. What's the big worry? Well, there is one really big long-term risk with UV exposure, and it can even happen with just one exposure. And that risk is skin cancer. Skin cancer is actually the most common form of cancer in the US. Now, this video isn't meant to be a scare tactic. Um, take care of your skin or you're getting cancer. No, but it is a possibility when we allow our skin and the skin system to be damaged repeatedly over time. There are statistics that say one time is enough to get skin cancer, but the likelihood is fairly low. Now, you probably know what you need to do to take care of yourself. The answer is simple, wear sunblock. It helps you prevent superficial and the potentially more serious possible damage to your skin over time. Remember, you work hard to take care of yourself as an athlete and be the best version of you that you can be. So why not also go ahead and take care of the largest organ that you have, your skin. If you like this video, you'd like to see more tips in the future, don't forget to hit that subscribe button right there in the bottom right hand corner. I'll see you next time.